Some games like Monopoly and chess are classics, but they never change. In the computer game world, the basic game theme may stay the same, but the way you can play it keeps getting better and better. Here to show us the fifth generation of a classic called King's Quest is Stuart Mulder of Sierra Online. Stuart, we all remember the old adventure games. I mean, the painful text entry, even the primitive low-res graphics. I mean, this is another story, isn't it? It is. Uh, for one thing, uh, the old text-driven approach is gone now. Uh, in this game, your character is controlled through a series of icons, which you can see at the top of the screen. Everything's done with the mouse. There's no typing yeah, at all. Let's make clear, we're playing the game now off a of CD-ROM, not off magnetic media. That's correct. Right? Because of the CD-ROM's storage capacity, instead of reading text, mm -hmm. you can hear the text spoken to you by real actors. Small pin, a spotted cow quietly chews her cud. So no little window, but the guy tells you what it is. Right. right. And then for main characters, you'll get a little close-up window. For instance, the companion, the owl, is going to speak here in a minute. Okay. If you're going into town, I'll just wait for you here. Mm. I had a nasty run-in with a big dog once, and I feel much safer out here. Uh-huh, so this is a lot different than the old ways. All, all mouse, no typing in words, no, I didn't understand what you said. Exactly. That makes the game a lot more accessible yeah, to people yeah. who couldn't type or didn't want to type. And obviously great graphics, and look at that, I mean, it's like watching a, a cartoon on TV. It's exactly what this is. It's interactive films. This is where yes. you can step in and you control the film, what happens in the story, uh, what your characters do, who they talk to, uh, what they do in the world, and, and the pacing of the story. Yeah. All right, so this is King Qu King's Quest number five on CD-ROM. 